Everton, uh, a 1-0 defeat today. You've, you've scored a lot of goals this season, but what would, do you think the main reasons were behind the lack of chances you created today? Pitch, it's killing us, absolutely killing us. I mean, that's possibly the worst game of football I've, I've witnessed, to be honest. And you've got good, you've got fans paying good money, you know, and it's, uh, I mean, let's not kill ourselves. We weren't great first half at all, but we've got good players who, who can, you know, run with the ball and get up players. But, the pitch is absolutely killing us, you know. Like I said, I keep harping on about it and I keep moaning, but you know it doesn't help uh, when you when you're a team that got good footballers in your team. Um, you know, we, the game as a spectacle wasn't great, you know, for the fans. A long time since your last game, a couple of, uh, just over a week. Um, did that disrupt the rhythm of your size? I don't think so. I mean, they're a the full-time outfit, and you know, the, the, I think they were the better side in the first half. But well, we've got we've been done by your corner again. One of our corners had to come out, and then you know they've. They've run at us. Uh, we've left ourselves short at the back, and, and, and the mistakes ultimately cost us the game because they have had a mistake again in there in, in our half, and we haven't punished it. Well, we've gone 90 minutes and not tested the keeper, and I, th I don't think Jordan's. Had, I think Jordan's had one or two saves to make. So the game was the game was poor to be fair for a, for the level that we're at. Um, but I think both sides, you know, suffered on on, on, on the conditions. Are you surprised at how low down and eating are in the league? Because they're no. quite good at the back and good going forward. No, definitely not. They were the they were, they were the best side that we played when we played them down there. You know, a very good football side. Um, well, like you say, you know, they are where they are. Anybody in this league can beat anybody. It doesn't matter if they're the top or the bottom. Um, and we we've got to start realising that because we seem to be up for the games when it comes to the teams in the around us. But then we, you know, we struggle. Well, I'm not going to be too critical of the players. You know, they've had a fantastic season, um, and we're in the quarterfinal of the FA Trophy. You know, one bad game today doesn't make them bad players, um, but you've just got to look at the reasons why, uh, and, 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 I, and I just think it's not conducive to the way we play. And a big game coming up on Tuesday now. Well, they're all big games at this stage of the season, you know, but they're only big games now because we've put ourselves in a position to be big games. You know, they're a big game because we're in the top seven, uh, and that's why it's a big game. But like you say, we, we we've got to play better than what we did. But hopefully we've got to. Hopefully the weather can change because, like you say, the you know the weather's killing us at the moment. You know I'm not nothing against the ground staff because you can only do so much on what they can do. Um, but the weather's killing us.